Hello everyone, this is Rahul from the Winsettle and I welcome you all to yet another interesting video. So in this one, we will talk about Windows 10 Redstone 5, that is Windows 10 version 18.09. So, you know, to be more specific, we will, uh, in this video, talk about uh, all the UI changes and improvements on Redstone 5. And uh, the Redstone 5, the official name for it has been decided now. So it is called Windows 10 October update in case you don't know. So without further ado, let's just dive right in, shall we? So let us first talk about Task Manager. So if I right click on here, then I go to Task Manager. Alright, so you see I have this uh, two new column here, Power Usage and Power Usage Trend. So, you know, as obvious as it sounds from the name, uh, power usage, uh, you know, this particular column, uh, power usage column, this column will provide an instantaneous uh, view of apps or services using power. Like I have OVS uh, 64 running in the background, which is, draw, uh, which is currently drawing very high power for my computer. And I also have task manager, which is drawing very low power at the moment. Um, on the other hand, I also have like a power usage trend column. Uh, this column provides uh, a power usage trend over two minutes for each uh, running apps or services. This column will be blank when you start an app, but will populate based on the power usage every two minutes. Pretty sweet. huh? Moving on. Let's now explore Windows settings a bit. So if I go into the settings and uh, so if I type something here, so what do I type? Mm, okay, so let me type theme. So when I copy it, they see I have this nice little icons now, which is very nice. Uh, I have like icons of cut, I have icons of copy as, you know, icons of undo, undo and all that good stuff. I also have uh, acrylic treatment here and also have a depth support which is very nice indeed uh, so yeah it's 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 subtle but yeah it's looking very good and yeah it's 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 a very nice little improvement now speaking of uh, nice little improvement you know when I go into the windows timeline and when I right click on here, they see I have a, you know, a acrylic background now, which wasn't there in, in Windows 10 April update. And it is looking very nice. So as always, you can snap, uh, you know, task, a task view on the left side, on the right side, and you can also move it in the new desktop, which is also, you know, which is also very sweet. And oh, wait. You know, Microsoft had introduced uh, a soft blur effect in the task view, uh, you know, in the background of the task view. A lot of people have it, but I don't, you know, and trust me, I'm on the, like, I'm on, I'm, uh, I'm on, uh, like, the on the latest uh, Windows 10 inside a preview build. Uh, I'm actually on Windows 10 build 17.751. Uh, like, if you don't believe me, let me show you. So if I go into the system, I go to here, okay. So yeah, OS build 17.751. So, you know, till now, I, I mean, I did not get it. I did not get this like soft blur effect or whatever. So I can't do a demo here. As you can see, I have no soft blur effect. I mean, yeah, what can I do about it? I mean, what the heck are you doing, Microsoft? Uh, I don't know. I just don't know. All right. That's how it is. You know, that's life. Uh, that's Microsoft life, right? And it is full of compromises. So, um, you know, moving on to the next new feature. Uh, well, I don't need to call it a feature. I certainly not. Uh, so, we'll, like, we'll talk more about Fluent Design here. So we'll talk about Fluent Design in Windows Defender Security Center. So let's check that out. So Windows Defender Security Center is now just Windows Security. So if I go to Windows Security, 
I open it. There you see I have also Fluent Design here which wasn't there in Windows 10 uh, April update. So I also have, so you know when I hover my uh, cursor over uh, all this menu, I also have this nice little reveal effect I think they call it. So yeah I also have a reveal effect and there's this uh, Fluent, uh, what they call it, uh, like uh, hamburger menu. Yeah, I have a fluent hamburger menu and I also have them here. I also have a reveal effect here, which is very nice. And last but not the least, you know, on Windows 10 October update, you'll find a new PDF icon. And let me show you how it looks like. So if I go to the file explorer, I go to the documents. All right. So you see I have this nice red uh, stripe here and on it I have uh, like it is PDF is written on the red stripe. So you know it is far far better than the previous one like on like Windows 10 April update you all you have was like the you know the Microsoft Edge logo which was you know it, it was very confusing. It was very confusing for like everyone I guess. So yeah, it's 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 subtle, but yeah, it's uh, it's a good change. It's uh, it's great. So yeah, that's it, guys. That's that's it. That's it for this video. And if you like the video, do hit the thumbs up button and don't forget to subscribe. With that, I would call it a wrap, and I shall see you in the next one. Bye bye and take care.